What up Evex Tech community? So today we'll be discussing about best CSGO settings for max FPS and smooth gameplay updated of 2022. So um, having high FPS in CSGO is always in one's favor as the game will load faster and run smoother. So plus if a player has, an, has high FPS than the other one, he'll be able to see the other player faster than the other one sees him or her. So how can you get max FPS? Here are the best options or best settings for getting max FPS and smooth gameplay in CSGO. So, let's get it! Okay, so um, the first thing that we need to do is to check Steam application settings. So we are on Steam window right now. So all you need to do is go to the Steam or click on Steam tab up top on the upper left corner of your screen. And then um, look for settings there. And once you're in settings, go to library or here, library. And then, okay, once you're on that page already, make sure that low bandwidth modes Low bandwidth mode is checked. Low performance mode is checked as well. Um, disable content, uh, a community content. Yeah, that is checked in show game icons in the left column. That is also um, checked. All right, make sure that all four options on this window um, are checked and hit on OK. All right, there. Okay, so the next step that we need to do is um, we need to set friends and chat options properly all right we need to make sure that it's set properly so we just need to go to uh friends tab click on friends tab all right and then click on view friends list and then go to settings and from here um you just need to make sure that um enable animated avatars and animated avatar frames in your friends list and chat is turned off okay by default this is usually turned on but we need to make sure that it's off all right so just click on um, the options here and just close it okay the next step that we need to do is to make sure that the launch CSGO launch settings is um, set correctly so all I need to do is just to open up Steam and then look for CSGO right click on the game and then uh, hit on properties yeah there and then make sure that enable the steam overlay while in game is turned off or unchecked okay and on this one on launch options uh, make sure as well that this copy and paste this make sure to copy and paste this all right and I'll put this one on the description down below all right and <clears throat> the uh, the numbers 240 just make sure that this one matches your uh, monitors frame rate or your your monitor's maximum frame rate so mine I got 144 so um, just change or edit the numbers okay the next step that we need to do is to make sure that the uh, DPI settings um, of CSGO is set properly alright uh, to do that we just need to uh, find the game exe so on my end it's in D all right but most of the time it's uh, in local disk C most of the time all right so I'll teach you later on so what we're gonna do is go to local disk D and look for steam library all right click on it open it and then go to steam apps go to common and then yeah click on CSGO counter-strike global offensive and then this one csgo.exe all right you need to find that icon so we just need to right click on that icon go to properties go to compatibility tab and then make sure that you uh, uh, click or check the disable full screen optimizations all right and also change high dpi settings click on it and uh, under high dpi settings click on um, override high dpi settings okay and then make sure that it's set on application and hit on ok right. there apply and ok alright there so on your end it's usually on uh, local disk C 
and you just need to look for um, Steam Steam library. All right, uh, we just need to look for Steam library option or uh, folder rather. All right, and once you're on that, um, yeah, you need to go to Steam apps and common. All right, you need to remember you need to go to common. All right common folder and then this is where you will find um, the CSGO folder okay the next step that we need to do is to make sure that the game is added on graphics performance preference we need to make sure that it's set to high performance so all you need to do is just to click on the start menu and then go to uh, settings or type in settings hit enter there in this window should appear and just make sure to look for gaming all right once you're on this window just click on graphic settings and um, try to add csgo.exe on uh, the list of games here available so for you to do that just need to find the steam library folder so for example on your end it's on local disk c you just need to find steam folder here okay and then um, click on steam apps common and then click on csgo and add this one and once you add it, uh, you'll be able to see it. Um, it will be added on the list. And just left click on it, uh, click on options, and make sure that it's set to high performance. Okay. And also make sure that your um, game mode is turned on. All right. Just click on game mode, and um, there should be a switch. But mine is turned on already by default. Okay. So there. So those are the two settings that we need to make sure that, um, that is set properly as well for you to get maximum performance on on the CSGO uh, on, on CSGO game okay so the next step that we need to do is to make sure that the uh, power plan is set properly all right or it's set to uh, its maximum performance as well so all you need to do is just to click on the start menu and type in like power power plan or choose a power plan left click on it and then put it on um, ultimate performance there and put it on ultimate performance or uh, in some PCs you only have high performance for example if uh, ultimate performance is not available in your computer you can also um, add it by uh, doing this process so all you need to do is just to uh, type in CMD uh, right click on it and run as administrator there and just copy and paste this command i'll be putting it on the description below type it here and then hit on enter and then just refresh the uh the power plan window and you'll be able to see the ultimate performance already okay the next step that we need to do is to make sure that the uh, nvidia control panel settings is set correctly so all you need to do is just to right click anywhere in this window and then click on NVIDIA control panel go to manage 3D settings go to program settings and then look for uh, CSGO if CSGO is not available you just need to add it manually click on add and look for um, CSGO or you can browse and look for CSGO here right there so once you um, added CSGO already, you just need to make sure that some uh, that few settings are properly set. So for example, on um, we need to make sure that low latency mode is set to ultra. There, you need to make sure that that is set to ultra, and then uh, open rendering GPU. Uh, we need to make sure that that is that your video card or your graphics card is set here as the default or right, so mine is 1660 ti so we just need to select that one and also for power management we need to make sure that your gpu is getting the maximum power from yeah from your power supply uh to ensure that it can perform to its maximum uh, performance as well and um we need to make sure that the preferred refresh rate um is set to highest available right that one and uh, tex uh, texture filtering all right Te texture filtering we just need to make sure that that is set to high performance okay and threaded optimization is set to auto there some other settings here are user preference if you want like um, very nice graphics 
you know if you think your computer can handle it you can put it on 16x you know the anisotropic filtering yeah so some other settings here are user preference it depends on you but those are the settings that i suggest that you should you should follow all right um for you to get maximum performance on your uh, nvidia for radeon or amd uh, i mean radeon graphics card i will be creating a different video for that all right so just uh, watch out for that video i'll make sure to create for that one as well in the near future so after after you're done just hit on apply there and just wait for a couple of seconds and that's it yeah okay the next step that we need to do is to make sure that um, uh, console command on your CSGO is activated all right like this one like what you see uh, like what you see on the window so in some cases it's not activated yet you need to manually turn it on so you just need to go to settings and click on game and then look for enable developer console all right so we just need to make sure that it's set to yes and then go to keyboard and mouse to see what um, character or what letter on the keyboard it's it is set by default all right to, to open it so for me it's this character which I'm not quite sure it, what it's called so please leave a comment down below and tell me guys what it's called all right so yeah it's like the character below I mean uh, beside number one but you can actually change it to whatever character that you're comfortable in using all right so once you've done it and just press that character on the keyboard and your console should be uh, good to go already but in case if it still doesn't work you need to restart the game turn off uh, I mean close and open up the game and then just type in these um, commands one by one enter it in the console guys um, there are just four commands available if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell for regular videos and how to fix and optimize your computer for both gaming and home use for free so peace